It's heavy. And here's the beer. Not even crying. stallions. Nobody can catch us because we're the best riders in the whole world. That's what'll bring us victory at Poitiers. You wait. We conquered Spain. Spain, incomparable in its beauty. But now, now we're closing in on France. This is the big one. It won't be easy. Poor friends, trapped in their heavy iron armor, their huge chariots of war, their big fortresses of pure granite. At noon, like lightning, we launch an all-out surprise attack. We swoop down on them out of the blue like thunderbolts, the messengers of Allah. In our white robes, we shine at the sun. And our castles aren't square, huh? We build cupolas and arcades. And pools and beautiful fountains and parks crammed with wild animals. Ah, uh, France will soon learn to accept us. Rest assured of that, because Abderrahman brings peace and prosperity. A whole new era is beginning. But hey, we brought the desert heat too, to melt the snow. There's not much snow in France. But what there is is perfect for making mint tea, Mario. Hey, if you've never had mint tea, you haven't lived. What are you looking at, Mario? The sky? It's true. It's beautiful. Hey, Mario. Candy Town. We'll go get a big ice cream coat, hmm? And then we'll go look at the tourists, okay? Uh. Hang on tight. Here we go. Last uh, stop. Come on, Mary, before I get murdered. For God's sake, where were you? 
They're all phoning at the same time from the campground. Pack all this fast and go and pick up your dad. And don't keep him waiting. Okay. Mrs. LeBlanc. Yes, ma'am? Is my lobster ready? Uh, no, I'm sorry. The catch hasn't come in yet. Sugar, Mrs. LeBlanc? Uh, the third shelf where the maple syrup is. No further. I'd better go. Fine. Oh, don't sit there, honey. You're in Mama's way. Good Lord, you're a mess. Look at your face. I'll take a bigger package. Well, it'll have to be. I've lost my hand. A big whale chewed it right off. Where's it gone? Hey, guys, I lost my hand. You gotta help me find it. Come on, eh? My hand, it just disappeared. I don't know. Well, well, what have we here? Looks like your little friend found it. Come on, put it back, huh? Hey, much better. <laughs> ah, you'll go to the altar carrying that thing, won't you? See you tomorrow. Okay. Well, how was your day today? Oh, I got through it. That was yours. I did too, I suppose. Come on back here fast, Simon. The customers are waiting for their lobsters. Won't be a minute. Later, fellas. You know, this war would be even more fun than when we let Riel and the Métis win. More fun than when we let the Aztecs kill Cortez. Because we've come to civilize the entire coast. Quite a job. 
The barbarians are finished wherever you look. People are at war. No one remembers the earlier civilizations. But now we are here. We cannot fail. Islam Mario. The infidel shall celebrate Allah. We'll start them off with science and algebra. We discover them, astronomy and poetry too. Same as we did in Spain. But we must cross the Pyrenees. And they're tough as bloody nails in Gaul. It doesn't matter. Because our Arab stallions are more beautiful. Plus much faster in battle. <sighs> Tomorrow at lunch, we'll go down by the water. I'll show you how to ride a purebred Arab stallion, Mario. This tale is about a young fellow. This tale is a la 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 la. Steady now. Good boy. Oh, I brought his favorite treat, an apple. <laughs> Giving yours a treat too, I see. An apple? A lump of sugar. <laughs> oh, I see. <laughs> a carrot. That should be it. Mummy. Mummy. Simon. They're still in the pot. Oh, that's... that's okay. Won't be too long, though. Another ten minutes. Doesn't matter. There's no hurry. Here for the summer, then? Uh, my name's Helen. Simon. Oh, Simon. <laughs> Your name sounds nice. Well... They must really suffer, huh? Ah, uh, no. It happened so fast, I don't feel a thing. Uh, Mario? Sorry. Uh, it's okay. Uh, um... All right, you guys, this is it. We must prepare for battle and prepare well. Just because we made it across the Pyrenees, did you think our mission was through? No! The infidels are close at hand, and they're making preparations too! And what are they doing? Hey! Who knows? Can we risk having them take us by surprise in the middle of the night? Of course not! 
And that's why we need an observation tower, so our sentinels will be able to see them at a distance in case they attack first. All right? And now I'm going to start with you, Benny. Go and find some boards, as many as possible. You, Pete, I want you to collect all the rope and the cable that you can lay your hands on. The rest of you, sails, tires, crates, nets, buoys, everything. And you know where to look. They're all over the place. Go try it down at, the, down at the Angel Bay or Fatima Bay. Sure, Fatima Bay. There's a big scrapyard down there. You'll find all kinds of stuff. All right, now, can I count on my warrior? Yes or no? I'll pick up the heavy stuff and we'll start this afternoon. We'll build a fort and a tower of such beauty. It'll be a monument to our... Uh, it'll... Where are you going, Mario? Take a look at you. you. Got a little dirty, that's all. Can you smile? That bad, huh? You're okay, don't worry. Look, Mario. He's not the enemy. Look at him, it's Danny. And look, Mario, this isn't a sword. It's just a big stick. You found a flagpole for us, right, Danny? Good work. Hey, Mario. Okay, let's go back and join the others, hmm? Hmm, you're not even limping. In a few minutes, you'll have forgotten it ever happened. How's your little boy Mario, poor thing? I suppose he can be a handful when you're on your own. Oof. Simon looks after him a lot. Too much sometimes, I think. Oh, well. As my husband always says, it's the Lord that made Mario, and it's not for us to question his wisdom. We each have our burden to... Uh, hmm? Could I have a couple of pounds of hamburger, please? Sure. I suppose the order up front is... That's um... right. It's for the campsite. A family named Balaje. The Belange family? Belange. They're in the blue tent right next door to that trailer. That blue tent? Right. Okay, perfect. Thanks. Okay. Mr. Belanger? Yes. Okay. That'll be $34.95, please. Simon. That's him. Helen. Hello. Hi. Hi, I brought your order. This is my dad. Hello. How do you do? Are you okay? Oh, I'm fine. You? So your name is Belanger. That's right. Well, surprise. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you do today? Not much. I've been trying to fix my camera. The mechanism's jammed or something. I can't get it to work. Here, I'll fix it in a flash. Get it?
Where'd you find it? You're doing great. Keep it up. Hang on, I'll give you a hand. There. Just leave it right there. That's perfect. So, oops, sorry. Oh, that minaret is perfect. That's where we're all going to gather to pray to Allah, to guide us to victory in our holy war. <sighs> hey, guys, have you ever seen such a beautiful fortress? They're marching. They don't have horses. They've got spears and lances, every deadly weapon imaginable. And their hairy, filthy, blonde hair hangs down their body. But it's half hidden by wolf's height they've got on, heads and all. With pointy little ears and cruel little eyes. And cute little mustaches. <laughs> don't laugh, these guys are ferocious. Especially their chief. Charles, Martel, a great warrior. We must be careful, because the enemy is at the gate. <laughs> and, uh, Martel's not just anybody. That's the enemy. This is going to be He's, uh, easy. Making do without Simon tomorrow, I hear. Well, it looks that way, yeah. Sounds like Andrew's so sick, if I took him out, he might kill the fish. You don't expect me to work without a helper. Not a helpless old man like me. Mm. <laughs> Enough of your tomfoolery. Can't make my deliveries by myself, though. I just hope the Lambert boy's available. It'll mean an extra expense. How about it, Simon? You're as happy as a clam about it, aren't you? Be nice for a change going out. 
And you can bet Mary would love to go. At the store, he'd just get in the way. Wait a minute. We won't have time to look out for him. Anyway, he'll get bored out there. No, he won't. Believe me, the boat's his favorite place. And you should never have brought him with us. You're too busy to do your job and keep an eye on him, too. Will you get that into your head? There isn't time, okay? Jesus! Simon. Oh, forget it. I'll hide this message in the fortress you built with your army. If you should find it, it will prove that we were meant to be together. This is our secret, darling Simon. I just hope and pray you'll accept my love and let me spend all my life with you here. You'll be my Arab prince forevermore, Helen. A bloodbath. They just wouldn't quit. But I tell you what we're gonna do, Mario. Tonight, a surprise attack under the cover of darkness. 20,000 horsemen thundering down on the enemy camp. <laughs> Can you picture it, huh? It's so what if they didn't have cannons back then? We'll use them anyhow. You like fireworks? Hey, Mario. Mario. You see them too? Horses are down there. They're coming closer. They're galloping so fast. A huge cloud of black dust. Raised by their pounding hooves, rises until it covers the whole plain. The noise is deafening, huh? Then,
marshmallow for Mario, one for Simon, one for Mario, and another for Mario. Hello? Helen! Sylvie and me happened to walk by. We saw your fire. Thought we'd take a look. Well, don't just stand there. Come on over and join us. It's nice and warm by the fire. Hey, Mario? Oh, wow, I love marshmallows. Well, don't worry. There's lots for all of us. <laughs> Looks sort of Arab. You know? A little. Are you saying that because the letter? Huh? The, the letter? What letter? You like marshmallows, Mario. Oh, you want one? Mm-hmm. For Pete's sake, Mario. Might as well give up on this one. Oh, well. Doesn't matter. Don't worry. How many you have it? One, two, mm. three? <laughs> three? Three? <laughs> You're the boss. Three. One for Helen, one for Simon, one for Helen, and one for Sylvia. Have to go shopping? No, no. Simon, there's a party at the campground, 8 o'clock this Friday. We can ask whoever we want. So I thought if you were free, I mean, you know, if you want to. Do you want to? Okay. 8 o'clock? Uh, good, 8 o'clock then. <laughs>
Okay, out you go. I'm telling you, it's no joke when Simon's not around. Right. I've never seen anyone squirm so much in church. And I bet at five o'clock mass he'll be there again with Simon and be as good as gold. If Simon ever decides to get up, now that the girls are chasing him, he'd probably rather catch up in his sleep than go to mass. Huh? Don't you agree? Yes, I agree. <laughs> well, if you're still this furious, we're ready to attack. They haven't got a chance, you hear? Come here. <laughs> I promised you a surprise attack. Well, we're going to have one. Tonight, you and I, we're going to go out there and attack that enemy camp and blow everyone's guy high. Okay. 
Okay. Come on. But keep down. <laughs> Look out! Okay. Keep going. We're right outside the enemy camp. There's the garrison. This is the palisade. We're gonna blow the drawbridge. Okay? They won't know what hit them. When this goes up, it's gonna be total chaos around here. Believe me. Come on. We've loaded the cannon. Now we've gotta light the fuse. universe was exploding. It was weird, though, where our tent was. There wasn't that much happening at all. I couldn't help wondering if maybe uh, you, you know, were when a... you're on a bike, your hair looks awful. Haven't you got a cap or a hat? You'd be much more beautiful. <laughs> well, if that's what you think. Hey, wait for me. I want to kiss. You'll have to catch me first. On this thing, come on up here. <laughs> See you later. Simon. Mm -hmm. What's your Arab fortress for, anyway? Huh? That's just a game for Mario. But why play a game about Arabs? I suppose because they... They live in another world. And so does Mario, in a way. I mean, he lives in his head. I wish I'd just walk into his head like we just walk into a church. I mean, then you could tell that. I don't like to talk about it. But what do you do together, eh? What do you tell Mario? We change history. <laughs> change history? But does Mario understand that? Oh, yeah. Mario's happy.
first Mario, now it's Helen Belanger. I can't trust you. Hello. I'm doing everything. And the customers are complaining because sometimes the orders don't get there. On top of that, I have to listen to the kids who tell me that Mario did this and did that. At your age, you should have a bit more okay, comments. Okay, this feature let me work. Excuse me. Afternoon. Hello, how are you? You're cold, right? It won't be long. Okay, smile. Aw, oh, Mario. Smile. Come on, I'm freezing. One more. Back up, Helen. Further, 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 further. Okay, that's it. Don't move. Okay, now it's my turn. I want a picture of you, Simon. Stand over there. Feel Can I take the pickup? You're getting old. You used to put your girlfriends in the bicycle basket. Can I or not? Go ahead, but remember, you've got to go and pick your mother up later. Hey, uh... 
Would it be too much to say goodbye to your brother? You know, a picture's just a picture, Simon. See ya. It's all right about the pictures. I'll take others, okay? And um, Sunday morning, if the weather's nice, we'll take Helen to Bird Island, okay? Huh? See ya. See those trees, Helen? All these birds shadow them so much they're all dying. Yes. Nice view, huh? Mm-hmm. Just over that hill is the ocean. Those clouds are just incredible. Uh, you can see a lumpy man and a big, huge woman. They're about to embrace.
never stop working now. What's happened, huh? Didn't things work out for you? I mean, it's, it's, it's been a while since we've seen Helen. Me and Helen are finished. Anyway, they've gone back. I haven't got much, much time. I'm on lunch break. We gotta prepare the Battle of Poitiers. I'll come back to that later on. Okay. What are we gonna do? Are we gonna take them by surprise? No, no, no. We'll hit him with the... with the cavalry. A lightning attack. I'm going. I'll be back, okay? See ya. Come on, I'll stay for one quick practice, okay? Where's the standard? Mario, go on, you're the flag bearer. Okay, but easy does it, you two. Okay, let's go. Take up your positions. Quickly, I haven't gone all day. On the double, come on. Okay. Until I give the signal, stay where you are. Good. Control your horses, damn it! Now. The enemy forces is at the bottom of the hill. When I give the signal, what do you do? All at once. Wait. No, you're going that way.
Of course it's not your fault. You shouldn't think of it in those terms. It's not easy to care for a problem child. And often, the older they get, the more difficult it becomes. That's why I've come here, to help. It was an accident. It might have happened to any of them. Kids, they always push each other. They, uh... Mr. LeBlanc, you must face that what happened is very serious. You've got to admit, in other words, that Mario demands more direct supervision than other children his age do. Besides, we're not, not putting him in prison or something. All I'm trying to get both of you to understand is we want to do everything possible to assist your child's development. I promise you, you're in for quite a nice surprise when you come and visit the institution. Plus, you'll still have Mario with you every Sunday afternoon, all day if you prefer. During the week, he'll receive therapy from specialists on an individual basis. Here on the island, there's no one that can help him. No war tomorrow. I've stopped it all day, Mario. Tomorrow. The two of us will visit Poitiers, the future capital. Incomparable in its beauty. And totally surrounded with water to keep away invaders. Except us two. I found a secret channel coming in from the sea. So now we can go and reconnoiter. You'll feast your eyes on the treasures of Pati before anybody. But we'll have to be out of bed early. At sunup, long before the enemy guard. The coyote's gonna wait for us here, Mario. Don't worry.
of Mario this weekend. Yeah. Simon. What? Uh, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I'm here for Mario LeBlanc. Oh, yes, I'll call someone to the desk to find him for you. Just a second. Ah, Mr. LeBlanc. Right? You've come for little Mario. Yes. Come on, follow me. So, how was the trip up? Fine. Mario's out in the yard. Mm -hmm. He's uh, all ready to go. I don't see why my brother is here. He's not mentally ill. No, of course not. Who's right? I know too, huh? Mario?
Do you understand where we're going?
Wait for me! 